Hey guys, it's Yazi and I'm back with another video. Um, before I start, I just want to say today is going to be my first video I'm making in current time, October, since my channel got monetized. So I'm really excited for that. So yeah, um, with that being said, I need y'all to go ahead and watch all of my ads. Any ads that pop up, you better watch it. You better watch it. If you're an OG subscriber, you better watch my ads. I know, but I would appreciate if y'all watch my ads, please. I'll be very grateful for everyone who does that. And if you're new here, go ahead and subscribe. Now that that's out the way, I'm really excited about that. But anyways, now that that's out the way, we're going to go ahead and get straight into the video. Oh, and um, before I start, I just want to let y'all know, this. I kind of did, I'm doing this video like on a whim, to be honest. Like, I want to hurry up and do this before I decide to wash my hair. So I don't really have any other hairstyles planned out. With, so with that being said, these hairstyles probably aren't going to be the best hairstyles, but it's just going to be a little something, something that I came up with off the top of my head, given the moment and time frame that I'm in right now. So yeah, let's go ahead and straight into the video. Okay, so y'all know me. Well, if you don't know me, you're going to know that every hairstyle video I always start off with the basic. And it's basically for this one, I literally just tuck my hair behind my ears like that, a little piece. And then, you know, you want to brush the hair in the back over it and boom, real cute. It stay out your face all day long and you look good at the same time. It's like a, it's like a, I just kicked my whole ring light, but it's like a slick back, but you got your hair down for it. Like, it's just cute. Like, y'all can't tell me this ain't cute. But yeah, I do this one all the time. It's not really a hairstyle, but... Okay, and oh yeah, I will show you guys what my hair looks like all down. This is how it looks while when it's just all straight down, you know, middle part bust down. That's what this look is given. So yeah, you can wear it all down like this, you know, this the usual what most people do. I also do this like every day. The last, the first hairstyle and the second hairstyle, these are like my go-to. And the third hairstyle is also something I do sometimes, but not really. Um, and if y'all are wondering what I use in my edges, I used um, Even Edge Control. It's a tiny little edge control. I will show y'all what it looks like, but I don't have it with me right now. But yeah, if you're wondering what I use on my edges, I use that. So yeah, if you if you're not really a side part type of girl, you can go ahead and just do a middle part. I mean, I, why am I calling this a middle part? You can do a side part. Now my hair is freshly straightened, so it should be laying down, not too shabby. And y'all, I'm using my literal phone camera to do this, so if it's not perfect, I am so sorry. But yeah, you can do like a light side part like this. It's more like on the not too much to the side, but just to the side. You could do like this look. Or I see a lot of girls, they like to do a whole, like a deep side part. And if you do this kind of part, I recommend you do some dramatic edges cause it looks really good. But I have other styles to do. So I'm not going to put too much work into each hairstyle that I do. So yeah, Andrew, you can do a little middle part like this. Hold on, hold on, hold on. My part getting lost, y'all. I'm literally looking at my phone camera while I do this. So if it's a little all over the place, that's why. Okay, y'all, like, I, this is so not aesthetically pleasing. Okay, finally. I found my part. It, it was lost in the wilderness for a while. So now I got to comb my hair out because that just got my hair all tangled up. Had to bring out my paddle brush, y'all. And I really can't see what I'm doing for real. Okay, so you can do like a um a middle part like this. And like you can put it more to the side like this where it's out of your face. But you also like, you know, comb it down. So it's like that straight up Aaliyah type vibe.
Yeah, this one is real cute. Real cute. But now we're gonna go ahead and just run it back to the middle part because if y'all watch my channel, y'all will know I'm not really a side part type of girl. Like they don't get me wrong, they're cute, but like it's just side part just fits my face more in my opinion. So yeah. So I'm gonna go ahead and get my middle part back. <laughs> For this hairstyle, I'm just going to take the two little front pieces of my hair and kind of like how I had tucked them behind my ear in the first place, I'm going to do that again. But this time I'm going to take a hair tie out of my little hair tie thing. Um, these hair ties, I got them from Shein. I really like them. They're really soft and gentle with my hair. So I really like them and they're very stretchy. They kind of feel like a cloth material if I had to describe them, but yeah. And I have a, a couple random hair ties in here, so I'm trying to get those out the way first. Okay, so I'm gonna get a little hair tie. Got two right here. And I'm just gonna take these two front pieces about this much. And then I'm going to do the same to the other side about that much. And I'm gonna take all of the rest of the hair and bring it back into a ponytail so that it is out of the way. And before I do the ponytail, I'm also going to take out like two little tufts on the sides like that. Yeah, I took out way too much right there. I'm going to do that. And tie, make sure you tie your hair out the way. If your hair is long like mine, you know you want to do like a little bun or something because if not, it's going to be in the way. So like that. Now I'm just going to take my brush and make sure it's smooth. And then also, I'm going to take out two little pieces of hair from up here. Like very small, about like this big from each side like that and then I'm going to take the rest of this hair and I'm going to bring it all the way back like this and then I'm also going to take out that same tuft of hair that I had out earlier and I'm just going to tie all of this hair back like so yeah I'm just going to take these two pieces of hair that I slicked back and I'm just going to put a hair tie on them and join them together and then once you do that you can go ahead and let your hair back down and honestly once you brush your hair down this probably could look good like like this to be honest but that's not the style I was going for so you can do some you can leave it like this if you really like it okay what's happening but yeah if you really like it you can leave it like this this is a cute little style that's unique and different <laughs> For the hairstyle that i really was gonna do i'm just gonna part kind of like a half up half down but when i do my half up half downs i like to leave more down than up if that makes sense because i like the down part to look just as thick as the up part if y'all know what i'm talking about y'all know what i'm talking about the girls that get it get it but yeah i just do that and then they're just going to bring it into a ponytail like so i'm gonna try to keep my part in it because i think the part is cute but if the part ends up disappearing, it just ends up disappearing. And I'm going to try to bring it kind of high up on my head. And if your hair is like mine and it's getting in the way in the back, just tie it away. Okay. Woo child. I am having a time with this hair. Anyway. So yeah, I'm just going to bring all the hair into a ponytail. And I was going to do it on the middle of my head, but I think I'm feeling like a high on the head type look. And since my brush can't I really slick my hair the way I need up at the top, I'm gonna go use my fine tooth comb. And once you got that ponytail where you want it, 
and pretty slick. Just go in with your hair tie and tie your hair up. And you could leave it like this, but I'm going to leave it like this. But if you want it to be like super duper cute, you should take a little piece of hair like this and wrap it around the hair tie like that. Um, if you do this in real life, I recommend using a bobby pin, but since I am not going anywhere, I'm just going to literally leave it like this. And then you're going to take out the back part of your hair. And you look a mess. <laughs> But you look a mess, so you need to just sit there and um, brush all your hair out. And you should get something that looks like this. Um, I'm just trying to make sure, trying to make sure my tufts of hair are out and stuff like that. And I want the ponytail to be kind of high, so that's why I keep doing that. And yeah, you should have something like this. You can put all the hair on the front of your shoulders, like I have it, or you can like you know bring it back more like this. And I just feel like this is super cute. cute and then a plate on this hairstyle i'm also gonna do a little bun with it if y'all keep notice like the angle keeps changing it's because i'm literally using this same phone to make a tiktok and i gotta do a lot of turn the phone this way then turn it back this way turn it back that way do way that way do, 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 do. so <laughs> it's just a lot going on anyway so like i told y'all i'm just going to use the same hairstyle for my next hairstyle and i'm not gonna lie to y'all i don't know if i want to do like a bun i'm gonna try it out first or if i want to do like a half bun like should i do a little bun what y'all think i i guess i'll do a little bun a little bun. People are probably gonna be mad at my bun because first of all, I didn't really try. So the bun doesn't look perfect. But this is how it would look if you were to do a little bun with this hairstyle. Okay, I just brought my camera up some more because I felt like I was like trying to sit up to show y'all stuff. But yeah, the bun, the bun is kind of cute. I ain't gonna lie. I'm not gonna lie. It's a little cute. Just, just a little bit. Just a, just, just a tiny bit. But if you want to do a bun, yeah, this is a look. Um, I could have fixed this part more, but since I'm about to move on to like more hairstyles, I'm not that pressed about it. But the bun did not disappoint. Now I'm going to do the hairstyle that I was already planning on doing that also uses this hairstyle. And I'll probably do one more or two more that uses like the same base. And then we're going to move on to something different. All right, y'all. My ring light is kind of on the gangsta wing. So if I'm leaning, that's why. I don't know why that's open. Anyway, so now I'm going to do the hairstyle that I told y'all I was thinking about doing in the first place before I did this bun just now. Yeah, I'm just going to take this little bun out, a little beat ball bun, and I'm going to do another bun, but it's only going to be halfway. So before you do this, you kind of want to brush your hair out so it's nice and fluffy. And then I'm just going to take this piece right here and I'm going to fold it inward like that and bring it down and then I'm gonna press it against my head and pretty much get this little poof part to the length that I want. Just rearranging it to get what I want it to do. Okay, so I think this is good. And then once you get the length that you want, you're gonna take another hair tie and put it on the little bun and you're just gonna tie it into place like so. And then once you do that, if it's not to your liking, you can literally just rearrange it and pull hairs until it's to your liking, which y'all can see me doing. 
and the hair tie is kind of showing a little bit so i'm just going to take a piece of hair and pull it and i'm just going to use that to cover up the hair tie so it's a little bit less of like an eyesore so yeah anyways now that that's covered i'm just going to go back to fluffing this up like this and you could leave it like this but i'm going to go ahead and add a hair clip because i think it will make the back look more it will make it look cuter i guess you could say so i don't know if y'all I don't know if y'all watched my other video, but if y'all haven't, it's gonna be right here. It's going to be my unique Shein's, Shein claw clips video. I'm gonna be picking one of those claw clips to use for this. Um, I seen a yin yang one just now. I think that would be a good choice with my fits. This one would be cute too, it matches. Hmm, I really like this little giraffe print. This this go good with my little bear shirt. This will go real good. Real bad, real bad. This this one really go with the shirt real bad. Um but the one I was going to use originally was this one. And I'm gonna pick, I'm gonna pick which one I'm gonna end up using, but like vote down below which one you think I should have used. Hmm. I'm gonna go with the yin and yang for the sake of the video just because it might add a little extra look to it but yeah i'm just gonna clip it in the back and i'm looking at my mirror in my room and typically i wouldn't tilt the clip more this way but i'm doing that for the sake of the video because i'm that's my good side so i'm gonna be recording from my good side but yeah once you do that you're just gonna fluff up a little puff and get it back to how you wanted it to look like that and boom you're done this is really cute and different. Now this is definitely like a, a hairstyle that's gonna get you some attention. So if you're not somebody who likes attention, I don't recommend doing these specific little sets of styles that I'm gonna do. And I'm gonna show you the other side, even though I'm not too concerned about that side, but it looks like this. And yeah, I think this is really cute. Really cute. Really good. And it plays on that claw, clip, claw clip trend that's going on right now. And yes, I bet you girl, if you go to school with this, I guarantee you most people are not gonna have this and if you're feeling extra extra you could even put like some little like i got these little angel wing clips you can literally put those right here and just you can go crazy with this to be honest i will go crazy with this but i just don't feel like it because i got a lot of hairstyles to go through Okay, so I think I have one more hairstyle that I'm going to do with these little front bangs and then it's time for them to go because the more hairstyles I do, it's just the more crazy my hair start looking. <laughs> so, I don't know why I left so much bang out right there, but it's pissing me off. So I'm just gonna take my comb and go ahead and create my middle part again. It might not be perfect. And if y'all see white speckles, I know it's time for me to wash my hair. I'm just trying to hang on to this flat iron as long as I can because girl, I ain't get no heat damage for nothing. Well, if I got heat damage, I ain't get it for nothing. Um, fingers crossed I don't have heat damage because I've been going kind of crazy with the flat iron every day. Anyway, so yeah, I'm just gonna make my part like that. And all I'm going to do is like, let me brush my hair out real quick. All I'm gonna do is do like two ponytails. And I imagined it in my head that it would look cute, so. That's why I want to do it right now. So yeah, I'm just brushing it up and I want to do like a high ponytail look. So I'm gonna bring them up here like that and put your hair tie up there like so. And then I'm just gonna do the other side. It's a lot going on in the back of my hair. We're just gonna act like it's not there. And guys, I know these hairstyles are like, these hairstyles are really cute. And I'm wondering, do y'all, if y'all wanna see all of these hairstyles or most of them on my curly hair, when I go back to my natural hair, my natural, when I, when I go back to my natural curls, I should say, if y'all wanna see it on my natural hair, just go ahead and comment down below. I'm gonna like, I'm gonna put a comment down there and y'all just like it. Like it's gonna be a pinned comment and just like it if y'all wanna see that. Cause I'm kind of interested in seeing it too myself, but yeah. 
So you could leave them like this, but you know how I am. I like a little extra pizzazz and a clean look. So I'm just gonna take a little strand of hair and wrap that sucker around here. And I also like how when you do this, it lifts your ponytail up a little bit, depending on how you wrap it. So yeah, I like that. Now I don't, I'm not doing the best job wrapping this because I'm trying to rush. I hate videos like this because I don't want to be too per trying to be too perfectionist trying to do this because I have a lot of hairstyles to go through but it's like I hate that I can't really help it like when it just don't look right I just be getting mad <laughs> but yeah I'm just gonna write this side too I'm gonna try to do better on this side because the other side is pissing me off but I don't really have the energy to go back and do it because the show must go on And yes, I got a lot of hair, so like my little wrap takes me forever. And as y'all can see, one of the strands need to be wrapped some more, but I'm, chow, I am over it, okay? So this is how this looks, very cute to me. It's a little, little on the childish side, but like, I don't mind childish. I think it's cute, really cute, really unique. You can bring your hair to your shoulders if you want it to make it look like you have like really long ponytails or something. Yes, yes. Okay, now we're finally retiring this hairstyle. We're going to move on to my next little hairstyle series. We're going to move on to the next style. Okay, let's just leave it. I'm not gonna lie, this hairstyle a little tight. Can't wait to take this out. And I hope my hair not breaking off from this video for y'all's sake. Oh no, look at this, y'all. Look what I didn't create it. I didn't create it or not. This is why you're supposed to take your time, y'all. My hair breaking off for this. I just can't. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Well, there goes some breakage. The, this is the behind the scenes, guys. I gotta leave this in here so y'all can see what I be going through. Oh, my hair feels so great to be free. Okay, this one came out how it was supposed to. Like, it, it wasn't a hassle. Like, her sister over here wanted to be a hassle. Yeah. Okay, because why does everything want to be stuck right now? Now that we got that out, I'm just gonna go ahead and uh, get my hair back into place. Look at it, it got bends in it and stuff already. Straight hair is funny. Okay, my hair is getting frizzy as we speak. So I'm just gonna take my fine tooth comb and I'm gonna part my hair on my good side. I don't know why I like this side so much, but I do. You know what, actually, before I do, before I do the hairstyle I was thinking of doing, I'm gonna do like a different, I'm gonna do more simple hairstyles just so that um, those can be out the way. So I, I've seen this hairstyle that I'm about to do on Pinterest one day and I cannot find a picture again. So I'm gonna have to try to do it like off muscle memory, which means that it's probably not gonna look like the picture, but it, it's gonna be something. <laughs> it's gonna be something most definitely. But yeah, I'm just gonna part my hair to the side like so okay it's so making a tiktok i know but yeah i'm just gonna part like my hair kind of down the middle like this not down the middle but like on each side if that makes sense where the side part if you were to make a side part in each side of your head wherever you would have that that's what i'm doing that's my best description y'all take it or leave it and then the rest of the hair, you know, I'm tied out the way because y'all should know by now, my hair, it likes to inconvenience me in any way possible. So yeah. And I'm just going to take this hair at the top and I'm going to comb it. Well, brush it if you want to be technical. I'm going to brush it straight back here like this. And I'm also going to part my hair down the middle. And 
then you're just going to comb your hair back with a comb as flat and away from the part as possible like this and i'm just gonna tie it with a little hair tie honestly i feel like i could have parted more hair than this but you get what you get and you don't have a fit <laughs> at this point I'm also gonna wrap a piece of hair around each hair tie. Y'all know me, but because the ponytails, I made them so small on accident, I'm going to use one of the hairs that are down instead of the usual. And before you do this, you know, you just wanna make sure your hair brushed out and then start wrapping. <music> Like that and I'm just gonna do the same to the other side guys so far this looks nothing like what I remember from the hairstyle on Pinterest but uh this is my best this is my best take of it y'all okay so this one's coming out but y'all should get the vision y'all should see the vision it's not exactly what it's supposed to be but y'all can kind of see it so something like this um if you wanted it to be more interesting you could add a little braid in the front but for the sake of this video, I don't want to do too much. No. Okay guys, so that's it for today's video. I am gonna make a part two of the, my straight hairstyles. So like, comment, subscribe to stay tuned for that. I will see y'all in my next video. I hope y'all enjoy. Comment down below what your favorite hairstyle was. And until next time, bye.